Hey guys, uh, this is the Vader Max Man here, and I have another uh, pickups video. This is just a kind of a quick uh, pickups video, but what we have here is a movie called The Mighty Quinn, and it is in fact on the beta format. Now, I believe this movie came out in either uh, 87 or 88, uh, one of those years. I don't remember exactly what year, but I just know this came out in the late, late 80s. And, uh, it has Denzel Washington in it, which is, uh, one of the reasons why I watched this movie. Uh, because he's just a really great actor, and, uh, he always plays his parts very well. But, um, this is kind of a weird movie because it's, uh, you know, Denzel plays a police officer in a small little suburb, little town in, uh, Jamaica. Um, I think it's, uh, Jamaica. But, uh, yeah, it's it's really kind of a neat uh, movie. I'm not going to say much more because anybody who wants to see it and hasn't seen it, I don't want to spoil it for them. But, uh, yeah, this is a great movie. Now I put it in this little plastic bag here to protect the cover. This is a very rare uh, tape. This is a pretty rare... Uh, beta tape, and so I thought I'd make a video of it just because of its uh, rarity. There's the back and the sides. I had to re-glue the uh, stickers because the stickers uh, came off because the glue just gets old and it deteriorates. It's got this bigger sticker on the back to cover up the VHS logo because in the mid to late 80s they started putting beta tapes inside of VHS uh, covers cases and they done this to cut production cost and they also knew that the format was dying and why make a smaller sized cover if you can just use uh, the VHS one. And they knew the format was dying, so they knew they wouldn't have to, you know, pretty much wouldn't have to really do much for, you know, beta. <clears throat> but it is on a Sony cassette. And it is... Here we go, CBS Fox, The Mighty Quinn. Now, I've already removed most of the stickers that were put onto it. It was, uh, I don't know if it was a video rental or if maybe it was uh, a public library or something that had it because there were a couple of barcodes that were stuck on the top of the tape here. And it looked like it might have been at a library or something. Because um, I do know that, you know, people would donate stuff to the public library. And the public library would let you, you know, check it out. And uh, so it, it didn't have, like, rental stickers like normal rental stickers like be kind and rewind or you know um the regular gray uh void warranty removed you know it had just a regular sticker that that said um don't tamper with this sticker or you're gonna have to pay for it so yeah that kind of thing but uh, yeah so, I took all the rental stickers off of it, and it's all in a uh, L435, L435 cassette. It's, uh, I think this movie is about an hour and 
uh, 20 minutes, so it's not very long. But, so yeah, I just wanted to show you guys a, a rare uh, title on the beta format, and I'm happy to to have this into my, my collection. So, I'm very happy to have it. And I hope that I get to... Um, I'm going to enjoy having this in the collection. And uh, I've actually got uh, a couple of new beta machines that came in. Um, two of the same ones. I've got two uh, SLHF350. Now the 350 is basically the SL100 with hi-fi stereo added. So the SL100 was a super SuperBeta. The SL um, HF350, which uh, basically added hi-fi stereo circuitry. So you've got SL100 with, with hi-fi. And, uh, and then they had the 360. Now the 360 is more common. Uh, that's the one that most people have or know of. Not very many people know about the SLHF350. Um, so it is kind of a rare one, and I will give you a glimpse at uh, one of them. So there's number one, and over there is number two. And I had a tape in it because I was testing it out, and to see what was going on with it. I already know what's wrong with it, and we're going to fix that. So sometime this weekend, we're going to do... Uh, a video on both of those units. We're going to try to get uh, both of them working. Uh, my original thought was buy two to make one good one, but then I thought, you know what, if I can make two of them work, that would be fantastic. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, I'm going to fix both of these units, and we are going to enjoy them. Let me zoom in a little bit so you can see what the 350 looks like now this one has the door is missing uh, but the other one does have a door and I've got a test tape I've recorded uh, the Goonies onto an L500 cassette off of a laser disc I copied it from a laser disc to make a test tape So, there we go, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video and look at um, a really good movie. If you haven't seen this movie, I recommend you do so. It's a very good movie. I enjoyed it quite a bit. Had a lot of, uh, it had some, some good action scenes. So, you know, it does have some good action-packed uh, moments and... Uh, yeah, so we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.